And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And it's first time around for these two countries in the group stage here at the 2023 World Cup. It's Sweden, and they take on South Africa. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Here's the starting 11 for Sweden. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And the lineup for South Africa. Well, 4 4 2 is a good formation if it's played well. It covers most of the bases defensively, and if you can then rotate your positions when you regain possession, you can also be fluid in attack. Let's hope we see that today. And so the match is underway. Stina Blackstenius. A really effective shielding under pressure. Plenty of options. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. The fans imploring her to shoot. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Well, they're going for the short one. Amanda Illestet. Opportunity! A goal in the early stages. Precisely what they had been planning. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. But I'm not sure the keeper should be beaten at that near post. She won't enjoy seeing that again. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Cezanne. Germain Seopusenwe. Oh, the threat is there. It might be. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long, and this match is level again. Well, just look at the defending here. They just don't read the danger. It's a poor goal to concede. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser, 1-1. One, one.
Mokhalo. Not high quality defending. Kosovari Aslani. Elin Rubinson. Filipa Angeldahl. Now options are plenty. And a long way out here. And a really good diving stop. Corner kick played in. Still not clear. Oh, cleared off the line. Alert defending. Must be. And a goal in the lead again. Fully deserved. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Well, two one it is here. Oh, she's in a really promising position. And it goes to square the game. What a contest this is turning out to be. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. So the ball is running again at 2 all. Oh, surely! Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Delivering it. And in! Oh yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. Well, neutrals are getting their money's worth. 3-2 in this match. Mokhalo. She's made a really good intervention there. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Well, the fans want her to take on the shot. Seo Posenwe. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Fridolina Rolfe. Stina Blackstenius. And Aslani. Good looking move, this. Is it going to be? Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Good technique displayed. Fridolina Rolfe. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, that's one for them to pursue. 
Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. And the referee has given them a corner. Played over. And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner, and she just finds that bit of space in the box, which makes the header so much easier. It's a very good goal. Just doesn't want to give the ball away. Noxolo Cezanne. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Now this could really lift spirits. And there we have it. She's only gone and made it a brace. Nobody can stop her. Well, just look at the defending here. They just don't read the danger. It's a poor goal to concede. Well, how about this? 4-3. Sophia Jakobsson in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here oh surely oh could be real defensive resilience Seo Posenwe not just trying to drive her team forward here and reading it absolutely superbly Blackstenius on to Aslani well, taking into account all the stoppage opportunity here can she put it away and a goal calls for celebrations again two in front Well, look at this again, because this is a really well-worked goal. The passing is incisive, the movement off the ball is bright, and it leads to a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a great goal. Goal. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. And so it is, the first half story has been written. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Crossing possibilities. Wonderful chance. And she's only gone and made it a hat trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Oh, 
And I must say, I'd have to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4. Bjorn. On to Jakobsson. It should be. It's gone in. Well, they're really in the mood here. Can they be stopped? Well, here it is. Head down, hit through the ball and get it on target. That's a top-class finish. There was no stopping that. Well, you've got to savour such moments. But a good piece of tidying up. And it's going to run through to the keeper here. And support available. A glorious chance. In it goes to alter the arithmetic and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, but you have to question the defending here. They don't attack the ball when it comes in. They don't react quickly enough to close the scorer down. It's really poor defending. Rolfe. Oh, big opportunity. And she's in the mood today. She's gone and made us a double. Well, here it is again. And the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. Goal for Sweden! Now well, we're into the final half hour. Jane and still they wait for the chance chance to reduce the arrears and now she scored not once but twice thoroughly enjoying herself out there well here it is head down hit through the ball and get it on target that's a top class finish there was no stopping that And if you enjoy high-scoring contests, this has been the game for you. Blackstenius. Aslani. Oh, the threat is there. Well, the supporters think it's on. And it might be. And that's two for her today. They just can't contain her, and no wonder she's off celebrating. Well, let's take another look, and it's not good enough defensively. They're slow to react, don't get tight enough, and don't deal with the situation. And there's the outcome. Goal for Sweden. 
Rather just again. Oh, a golden opportunity for her. Aslani. Can they convert? And she's kept it out. And they will make the change now. Corner kick played in. Well, pressure building. Another corner. Elects to go short. Seo Posenwe. Might really be able to trouble them here. Really good interception. Might be able to set up the chance. Can she do it? Surely. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. And the substitution will occur now. And a short corner, let's see. Behind for another corner, can they cash in? Well, they fancy a short one. And take it away. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Well, the counter chance looks very real. All hands on deck. Well, strong play here. That's a well-struck pass. A good and fair challenge. Aslani. And slipped through beautifully. Will it be? Oh, it's goalkeeping at its finest. Absolutely right. That is a wonderful save. Top-class stuff from the keeper. Short corner taken. Just the challenge that was required. Linda Mothalo. Five minutes to go. Excellent vision. It's a good looking ball in behind. And there it is. She's done it to give them a real chance. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. But I'm not sure the keeper should be beaten at that near post. She won't enjoy seeing that again. Sega. Here's Jakobsson. This could be it! And that's a high-quality stop. Well, it may not count for anything, but that was a great save, wasn't it? If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story.
It's a short one. Firing it towards goal. Well, for power, 10 out of 10. For placement, maybe 8. Rafilo Jane. Well, do they have it in them to level this? This could be the equaliser, but no! When your goalkeeper comes up with a save like that late in the game, you have cause to be thankful. Well, that could be a key moment. They have to take those sort of chances. They won't get too many more, but let's credit the goalkeeper. Playing it in. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Can they convert? And able to get a body in the way. And there goes the final whistle. It goes into the history books as a win for them. So, morale is high. Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes, and they fully deserved their victory today.